Hello everyone, welcome to a new episode of Explore and Engage with Anam. In this episode, I would like to talk about the city of San Francisco in the state of California. Now, before we go there, let me just make some brief comments about the real estate market in the United States. Now, I'm not an expert, but I can tell you that the real estate market here in America it's very interesting right now. I mean, that's pretty much all I can tell you. Um, and if we want to talk about Madison, Wisconsin, the city of Madison in the state of Wisconsin, where I live, the real estate market here, it's really very interesting. I mean, houses are in high demand. People are looking to move to Madison. And so houses are in high demand and those who are looking to sell their houses here in Madison, they are, they are getting very good price and houses are being sold really fast because Madison is where a lot of people want to move. And that's, that's what's happening. So any seller who's putting a house on the market, that property is likely going to be sold really fast if it's in Madison, Wisconsin. Now, that doesn't seem to be the case everywhere. Okay, there are certain places in America that people no longer find desirable. There are some desirable places where people want to move and there are some places that are not so desirable anymore. And so those are places where people don't want to move. And those who are living in those places, they want to get out. And so San Francisco, it seems to me that it's 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 a place like that 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 people no longer find desirable that's the name that comes to mind if you try to think of places in the united states cities in the united states that people no longer find desirable now my realtor friends say that location is the most important thing when buying a house and it's not just for a private home Okay, location also matters a great deal if you're looking for office space or if you're looking for other commercial space. And location simply doesn't mean physical location. There are lots of other things to consider. If you're looking for a house, you may want a common quiet location. You may also be looking for good schools in the area and you may also want to be uh, perhaps close to the beach or um, up on a hill with a great view and you may also want to be close to shops and stores and restaurants or perhaps you want to be close to the local library and the hospital and the medical clinic. People have different preferences whether they're looking for uh, a private house or they're looking for some kind of commercial or office space. But location is more than that. People need public safety. People want to be in a safe place. They want to be in a safe neighborhood, in a safe community. And so there are buyers, when they're looking for property, they are looking to be in an area with a good police department that has the resources and training necessary to maintain law and order. And then people may also want to be in a county with, with a district attorney who prosecutes criminals who does his job to make sure um, that, um, you know, um, uh, c criminals are prosecuted and, and that uh, the community stays safe. And then buyers may also want to be in a community with an excellent fire department and EMS services. And then buyers, when they are looking for property, they, they may be looking for an area where the local elected leaders govern in a way that protects people's freedom. And so there are many different things that people may consider when they are looking for a property. Now also, um, people, they likely want to be in a place where there are good employment opportunities, communities where people work hard and enjoy the fruits of their labor. And so in a place like San Francisco, now let's talk about San Francisco. In a place like San Francisco, poor governance has resulted in homelessness, 
poverty and widespread drug use and abuse. And the streets and roads are not very safe, not anymore. And whether you're a driver or a biker or a pedestrian, San Francisco is not a safe place anymore. And no doubt it's, it's a beautiful location. And once upon a time, it was a very beautiful city, but that may no longer be the case. You know, it, I, I just think, and this is my assessment, and so let me know if you disagree. I think that San Francisco is no longer a desirable place because it's full of problems. The liberals have run the city so poorly that people are now leaving San Francisco. It's, it's still an expensive place to live, but the quality of life is no longer good. And so no wonder that many San Francisco residents are, are looking to get out of the city and they are looking for better place, better places to live and for raising a family. So once upon a time, a very beautiful city. It was a very beautiful city, San Francisco. Now the city is facing a crisis and that's because of liberal leaders and their failed policies. But don't worry. If you are a San Francisco resident and if you're looking to leave the city of San Francisco and if you're looking for better places for living, for working and for raising a family, then there are lots of other options out there. America is a great country and there are many, many, many wonderful cities where people can live happily, they can work and they can raise a family. So my friends, that's all. Wanted to talk a bit about San Francisco. Share with me your thoughts. If you have any comments, you can visit my website, tossifanam.net. You can send me a message. You can also find me on social media. So share with me your thoughts and views. And I hope to be back again soon with a new episode of Explore and Engage with Anam.